So I got the winch working. I put the rope on. It's quite a lot of rope. I did, I, yeah, I didn't even think it was going to fit on, but it fit on anyway. Yeah. Looks useful. So, uh, we'll just have a quick look around. So, yeah, it's a fucking winch. Uh, and it's attached via a uh, receiver hitch here with a pin there. Uh, the receipt this tube is five mil wall 50 by 50 by five 50 box section with five mil wall the bumper is like 10 or 11 mil uh, so yeah I think I think it's gonna be strong enough to hold up I added lots of metal to the plate the plate is this plate is eight mil thick and where the 50 mil box joins it I basically welded a new island there in the middle of the world. I added like, I don't know, about a kilo of weld, not a kilo, about half a kilo of weld. So it's definitely melted on anyway. Um, I added these bits here, but I need to shore up the back of them a bit more. There's not enough metal at the back, so I wouldn't be pulling out of those just yet. They need a little bit more work. Uh, right, so we can see the connection, right? Anderson connectors. Uh, uh, right, so this is uh, two welding cables, 50 mil squared, inside a sheath that runs underneath the car the whole way to the back. And there's the second receiver hitch, so I can plug the winch, I can mount the winch there on that receiver hitch also. And there's the Anderson connector for it there. You can see it's got this protective cover thingy. So there's, that's where it terminates. Plug the winch in there. We have winch on the front and the back. Woohoo. So that's it really. Ready for the mountain tomorrow. And that's it. So when not in use then I would plug both these out and have a relatively safe form of transport. And they just sit like that. Right. So... Yeah. It looks ready. Right, bye.